So from this day, what did Joshua say to the people? Sanctify yourselves. For tomorrow, God will do wonders among you. He understood the power of sanctification. The power of separating yourself from the wrong things. The power of purifying your mind and your life and your way. There is a way of life that is not right. And if you're going to pursue the purpose of God in your life, then you've got to have purity. I want to show it to you in the scripture. You can't live any way you like and really expect from glory to glory. No, it can't be from glory to glory. There will be, uh, the Bible says, foolishness from the mouth of, the, of, of someone that's reputed to be wise is like a dead fly in an ointment. Do you get it? Foolishness from the mouth of someone reputed to be wise. It's like a dead fly in an ointment. That means a dead, a stain, something, something just not right. So you find there's a lot of power. There's a lot of revelation. They say, come. So they say, when the man preaches, his message is good. But you know what? The result, the result is not there. It's healing the sick, casting out devils. But you can't really see much progress. Are you following this? So all the progress you will see with him will be earthly progress. So earthly progress. Oh, he has cars. <laughs> so that's what you have to do. Because those will be the symbols of his success. You build a large facility. But people's lives are not changing. He's not making the spiritual impact. Why? Because his way is not right. His life is not right. So he's not really working with the Holy Ghost. He's working with what we call the impartations of the Holy Ghost. Amen.